Hey all, hope you all are fine. Welcome to my channel, Sri World of Coding. This video is, is continuation with my previous video in which I have showed to deploy a machine learning model using Streamlit and Docker. And today, what I am going to do, I am going to link my Docker app with help of Jenkins. So, uh, as you can see, this is the Docker file that I have made in my previous video. And my app uh, and my Docker container is already running. So, I will let you show this. Uh, I will just copy paste the URL. Okay, so it is getting loaded. So my Docker app is running fine. So what I will do, I will just stop this container. And, uh, remove, uh, and also delete this container. Uh, So and uh, so now let's create a Jenkins file. Then Jenkins file. So I've already copied this. I will paste it here. So this is my uh, Jenkins file. It is written in Groovy script. So what I am uh, writing is that uh, whatever the available agent is there, uh, utilize that. It means the worker node in my uh, uh, Jenkins files I am creating a pipeline so there are various stages so first stage is clone repository okay and this what I am doing I am just uh, doing uh, doing a command of git clone and the github url so I will show you I have already put my code to this uh, to github with repository name and salary paid docker in which all my files are there this is my docker file okay and and this is my app.py oh sorry the main uh, script so this is my jenkins files i uh, this is now empty i will just uh, after explain this code i will copy paste it there so what i will do next uh, stage is building of image so this is the command that we will use to build our image third is that after build of image third stage is run the image so this is the command that is used to run the container mm -hmm. The container name is celebrant and this is the image name that I have specified here. So I will just copy paste this in my github repository. Uh, okay. So uh, um, I have updated the repository. Now let's create a new item. Jenkins. Docker. UI. Uh, let's give a new MLA. It should be a pipeline. Click on OK. Um, it should be pipeline from SCM. SCM is my git. Okay. I should have to provide my URL. Okay. Potential is this. And branch I'm going to use is main. So far, so good. So, uh, what I have specified in my Jenkins URL, check out SCM is the same with this command. It will take this URL and will clean it. Let's click on save uh, and click on build now. The build uh, might take some time because it is running, creating a docker image and running the container. So let's check. There is a new app named. Okay, so as my script has run, it has created a container just seven seconds ago. Okay. Uh, the build of image might take some time. I will resume this video after my uh, build of my pipeline is complete. So finally, uh, through Jenkins, uh, my 
image got built it took some time okay so all my messages are print so there is no error so let's check in my node whether uh, okay, the container has started okay so let's uh, let's check uh, whether my now i'm able to run this app or not stream letter so yeah it's running fine uh, you might face some common errors such as uh, uh, for example Jenkins is not able to uh, run your docker app because uh, while running through Jenkins when you run when you create an uh, item it is, has Jenkins privileges so you need to have privileges to uh, run the docker command so so basically Jenkins is a CI CD tool okay that stands for continuous integration and deployment so through this video I showed how to link docker with Jenkins and run docker command with the help of Jenkins. Hope you like this video. Thank you and have a nice day.